Okay, so now we're going to get started, and I'm not going to go in any specific order. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so first, my friend Allie, she got me this shirt. It's like, okay, it's like a sheer see-through um, top that is like a corally orange. And actually, the necklace I'm wearing right now is what came with this shirt. And it's very simple, but um, the necklace makes it look nice and I like it. It's very flowy and it actually, the front part cuts off a little higher than the back. And um, I, I like it a lot. Thanks, Allie. And um, yeah, she got it from Kohl's, by the way. And it's a very pretty top, if I say so myself. Okay. Next, I have the Milani face powder in the color dark tan. Because I have a dark tan. And it comes with the powder and a mirror. Oh, just shine the light in your eye. But, um, and it came in a floral print. But as you can see, it's starting to fade away. But it works really well, and it stays on for a long time. And it's gold. It's it's very pretty. It's like a gold coin that you can like insert for money and stuff. But um, it works really well. And my mom bought it for me from CVS, and it's a drugstore product. You should go pick it up because it works really well. Next, okay, there's a story behind this. I have never had EOS, and when I first got it, I honestly thought it was EOS. Like, I walked into school and I was like, hey guys, I have EOS. And they're like, you mean EOS? I was like, oh, it's called EOS, which makes a lot more sense. But it works pretty well. I mean, it's a pretty good chapstick. Go get you some EOS, or as I like to call it, EOS. But it's pink, and it's in ball form. Perfect. Next chapstick is Burt's Bees Nourishing Lip Balm with Mango Butter. This stuff works amazingly. Like, I'm wearing it right now, and my lips were, whew, they were chapped. And I put some of this stuff on. The next morning, my lips were soft as a baby's bottom. They were chapped, I tell you. And no chappedness anymore. But this works really well. You should go get yourself some. I got it from Walmart. And, yeah. Use my birthday money with it. Which I got $200 worth of birthday money. Thanks to all the fam fam out there. And um. Yeah. This works well. Next is the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Lip Gloss. Okay. The story behind this. I actually didn't buy it. Nor did any of my like. Anyone actually bought it. It was in the little happy birthday thing from Bare Minerals, I'm guessing? Yeah, Bare Minerals. And it came with a, like, it came with a little beauty supply thing in this little cylinder. And let me tell you, this lip gloss is $17 and it works so well. But I probably will never buy any more because I don't have that kind of money, but if you have this kind, of, that kind of money, take the time, go to Bare Minerals, wherever you can find one, and get this lip gloss because it acts like a chapstick, but it also makes your lips shimmery, and it it's like a pink with like a shimmer in it, and when you put it on, it you feel it tingling, working your lips, and it also smells like mint. And if you have bad breath, maybe, just maybe, it'll cover it. Just a little. 
but it works so well. So, if you can afford it, go and buy some. Next! Okay. Oh. Sorry about that. I dropped the pen. So, me and my friend Alyssa, there's a story behind these pens. There was actually four, but I lost the red and purple one. Okay, so she had these pens, and I always would ask her for to use them. And I guess she got annoyed after a while, and she bought them for my birthday. They had red, purple, black, and blue. And I've already lost the red and purple one, so I'm down to black and blue, which are the essential colors anyway, so. But, um, these work so well, they, like, glide on the paper. And when I, like, write my signature or sign my signature, like, it just keeps going. It flows with my hand. That's how you say it. It flows with your hand. And, yeah, these are amazing pens. They're the Papermate Profile 1.4B pens. So, go buy you some. Um, next... Okay, so we went to Sephora because my mom treated me to a Sephora shopping spree, kind of. And, um, they're so nice. They gave me two free products. They gave me the Smoky Extravagant Makeup Forever Professional Paris Mascara. And the brush is, like, huge, man. And... I haven't gotten to try it yet, but it looks like it makes those eyelashes huge. And it also came with this, um, the Rouge N9 lipstick by Makeup Forever also. And it's like a little, like the half size one. It's just half size, it's small, they're both small. But I love the lipstick, I'm actually wearing it right now. It's just like a pink fuchsia color like a lighter fuchsia and that's how it looks like I think it's a nice color don't you yep yep so thank you Sephora for this beautiful birthday present next is okay you know how I was talking about the Sephora shopping spree it wasn't really a shopping spree I got one thing from there but it was a pretty extensive thing so I think I made up for a lot of things I could have gotten. So I got the Naked 3 palette. And all my friends had it. So I was like, gotta get it. Because they said, everyone was like, it's so good and blah, blah, blah. Ah. It's the perfect palette for me. Let's just say that. Ow, ow. But, yeah. Urban Decay, you have outdone yourself. It's sheer perfection. Perfection. I give you a 10 out of 10. And also, it came with this four week um, primer thing. Like, they give you a sample of each of the primer, eye pri eyeshadow primers. And how nice is that? Four weeks? That is so nice. And, yeah. I plan on using it, too. Four weeks of eyeshadow primer for free. You're so nice, Urban Decay. Like, you're my favorite place now. Give us free stuff. Like, seriously? Next is a statement necklace. Um... My mom bought it for me from Dress Barn. I don't know if, like, there are many around. But there's one at, across from our mall. And it's very pretty. It's, like, white with gold, if you can see it. And it's a little bit longer than usual. Like, it droops down a little. But, um, it's really pretty. And it also goes with my Easter dress. So, it's a score. And, um, yeah, if you have a dress barn, go and buy one. We could be twinning. Um, next is 
the Flawless Touch Eye Primer from, where's it from? Oh, it's from Sally's. And yeah, it, I haven't gotten to, actually, I actually haven't gotten to use it yet because I've been using this other eyeshadow primer that I'm going to tell you about later in this video. And, but I will get to use it. And it looks like it works well. So we shall see, won't we? Um, next. Yes. It's what it looks like. I got something from Tiffany and Co. <sighs> yep. You thought correct. Your girl got a bracelet. I actually got this from my godmother slash aunt yeah she's my godmother and she's my aunt don't judge but um it's the one with the heart charm on it that says tiffany oh please return to tiffany and co new york 925 and i actually don't know how much this costs but i know tiffany is so expensive so it cost her a pretty penny and yeah i wear it a lot and it goes with all like pretty much everything so it's a score for the Tiffany bracelet so if you can afford one or if you can afford one but still want one go and buy one because they're perfect and it comes with a little pouch that says Tiffany and Co and it does that drawstring thing and then it came in a box and it was wrapped in pretty ribbon but I couldn't mimic it so yeah so now it's just in the box because I don't know how to do the white ribbon thing that they have. And I kept the bag and the little polish thing because I think that one you're supposed to keep. But yeah, Tiffany & Co. Next is the Fit Me Shine Free Foundation from Maybelline New York. And I have it in the color Cappuccino, the 340. And... It works so well, I actually am wearing it now. And that's all I can say about it because it works really well. And yeah, go buy it from pretty much any drugstore near you because I think it's Maybelline sold everywhere. And yeah, Maybelline, good job. Next, K. Okay. this is the eyeshadow primer I was talking about. This eyeshadow primer costs $26 from Ulta. And it's called Stay Don't Stray. And it is by Benefit. And I'm in the color Medium Deep. Although it's expensive, it does work really well. And the shadows do stay put, as it says on the bottle. And here's the little brush thing. Yeah. And it's a pretty bottle also, so. Um, the, it's worth its $26. I'm getting the $26 out of it. And I still have a lot to go. So go buy you some Stay Don't Stray. Because it works really well. The next one is the M Milani Brow Tint Pen. The Felt Tip Brow Color. And I'm in the color, uh, oh, two, number two, the dark brown. And it's just the for your eyebrows. It's like a little felt tip pen that you just draw your eyebrows. But it's not a pencil. It's a felt tip pen. Hmm. But, okay, yeah. It's amazing. Next is also by Milani. It's the Li Ultra Fine Liquid Eyeliner Number no. 1 Black Vinyl. And this thing works so well. And I'm actually wearing it right now. Ooh, I don't know if you can tell. But yeah. Um, I've been using it every day because it's so good. So Milani... Keep doing what you're doing, because this stuff works amazingly. 
Next, also came in the little birthday cylinder. It's the Bare Minerals Lash Domination. I actually use it with the Maybelline Cat Eye, the one that comes with the in the yellow bottle with the cheetah on the top. Um, those two together create perfection. That's the only word. Like that's my word for today, perfection. Um, and it has like a zigzag, like the brush is zigzagged. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it like zigzags. And it works really well. Creates a lot of volume and length. And them together just double it. Perfection times two. Next, my friend Alyssa also got me this. Um, it's the City Proof Intense Lip Color NYC by NYC. And it goes up and then it goes down. Um, it's a pretty color. It actually goes well with my skin tone. And it's in the color Parsons Pink. So go buy yourself some. Yeah, it's a twistable. Who wouldn't want a twistable? And last but not least are my perfumes. Oh wait, never mind. It's not the last one. I also have the Bare Minerals Lasting Line Long Wearing Eyeliner. Eyeliner long. Oh, I was reading it in a different language. Huh. But it's the twistable eyeliner. Blah, 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 blah. And I'm wearing it right now. Can't really tell. Uh, but yeah. I've been making a lot of sound effects. I'm so sorry. But um, then it has the little gel eyeliner thing. But I've, I lost the cap, so I don't... Uh, uh, nothing I can do about that. Now are the perfumes. The first one, my godmother slash aunt also bought me this. It's the Guess Girl by Guess. And one second. It's a really pretty bottle. It looks like this. It's kind of like a rose. And it smells... <coughs> Sorry, I know too much. Like, it's like a professional scent, but for teenagers. Like, you know those perfumes that are, like, all, like, old lady-ish? But this is, like, teen old lady-ish. I don't know how you can use that. But it makes you smell professional. Like if you're in a professional setting, wear a guest girl. But it still smells young. So however you take that or interpret it. And the next and last perfume is Victoria from Victoria's Secret. Eau de Parfum. And this stuff smells amazing and can I say this bottle is perfect. Um, it has a bow on it. I like bows. Cheerleading bows, hair bows, doesn't really matter. And, yeah. It has a bow on it. And also, what do you know, it smells good. But I'm gonna be honest. The only reason why I bought it was because it had a bow on it and it was pretty. Like, I didn't even smell it in the store. I just bought it. Just dropped $50 and hope for the best. But it smells good, so that's you to worry about. You just want to spray it everywhere. It smells really good, though. Go buy some Victoria from Victoria's Secret. Well, oh my gosh, I almost forgot about the shoes. Okay. So, my godmother slash aunt lives in Atlanta, so she has all the shoe hookups, and first is this shoe from Shoeland. It's in Atlanta, don't ask me, and it's a wedge, it's a tan wedge with spikes on the back, and it's a peep toe, and... They are so cute. I've been wearing them a lot lately to like church and like special events. So yeah. I don't know if you can go find them. I'm sure they make some stuff similar to them. 
And then next is these, these brown felt shoes. It has a little buckle on them too. And they are so cute. They are wedges also, as you can see. And it's in a size nine, my size. It's a style Delaney. And they're very comfortable also. So if you can find them, go get yourself a pair or something similar. And last for the shoes are these. And I've been wanting these kind of shoes for you don't even know how long. Um, they have the new boot smell. But yeah. It's amazing. I've been wearing these and like around if I'm going shopping or something. So yeah. I'm they make plenty of these, so these are really easy to find. So go buy yourself a pair. They're really comfortable and go with a lot of stuff. And then my mommy, she bought me paintings for my room. And first is this one. It's from Home Goods, and it's a really pretty painting. It's a dress, obviously. And yeah. And then there's another one, which is also a dress, which is this one. And yeah, it's an oil painting, so um, they're really pretty. And can you see my face behind this? I don't know. But yeah. If you have home goods and if they still sell these, because I know they don't sell that much of the products they get, go buy you some. And it was an early birthday present, so they might not have it, but it's worth a shot. So that's the end of my birthday haul. I hope you enjoyed it and like down below if you want other like haul videos and subscribe and comment down below what kind of videos you'd like me to do and I hope you have a happy Easter and have a good day. Bye!